What's going on you guys? This is Apple Tech and today we'll be taking a look at a pretty different style of video. It still has to do with electronics but not particularly on the iPhone or any jailbroken stuff but hey if you guys want to see more videos like this on me reviewing little products that maybe you would like to pick up then feel free to drop a comment or hit that like button really appreciates and just shows me that you guys want to see more videos like this so back to the product itself we'll be taking a look at the u816 this is the udirc it's a pretty long name but basically it's just a ufo helicopter that you can pick up from tmart.com. It retails for $44.95, which is a pretty steep retail price, which I will be testing it to see if it's a good product worth the price tag and if you guys should get it in the long run. So enough of me talking, let's hop right into this video. So jumping right into this unboxing and review of the U816 UDIRC. It's basically a quad helicopter, also comes with an LCD remote. Taking a look at the front of the package, you got the name of the product. Towards the bottom, this LCD remote is packing a 2.6 gigahertz. It also has an age restriction and the product in the front. Now flipping the package to the back, you can also see that this helicopter has a little tricks up its sleeve. And you guys can also see that it gives you a little bit more information about the remote, labeling each part so you get a better knowledge of it and how to use it. Now inside the package, you will be first greeted with the instruction manual, which will list all the products that come inside. So you get a pretty good sense on what goes where. However, I'll be labeling the products that come in the package. Starting off, of course, with the quad helicopter. Now this looks pretty small and on it, you will see four repellers. You also get four extra, as I was mentioning. You also have a USB cable to charge the two batteries, which is pretty good. You can have one and charge one at the same time. You also come with the charger box, which you will plug in the USB. Now, last thing you will get is, of course, the LCD remote, which is pretty cool. It has an LCD showing you on how fast your helicopter goes, and which is pretty cool on the remote actually having an LCD screen. Now the only downside I found about this is the package doesn't include four AA batteries. That's what you will need to power the LCD remote. Of course you can get some on your own and you will need a screwdriver. Simply screw off the back and put in your four AA batteries. It's pretty great even with some cheap low end AA batteries. It gave me a long stretch of time to use it. The only problem I had was pretty much the helicopter gave out before the remote. So the little batteries on the helicopters won't last you a long time. Pretty much 10 minutes of flying time. However, that's not the only problem I had is when connecting it to the helicopter through Bluetooth, it pretty much disconnected every time the helicopter would fall. Now, as I said, it comes with a charging box and the USB. This is what is used to charge your two batteries. So what you want to do is plug in your batteries and make sure one's charging when the other one's inside the helicopter. So it won't be that irritating when one battery dies, you still have another one to fall back on. However, it's pretty simple when putting the battery in, it has a little slot on the bottom of the quad helicopter, which you just snap in and pretty much lays beneath the quad helicopter. So enough of me actually talking about the product itself. I actually tested it outside, got some footage for you guys to see and if it amazes you or if it disappoints you, feel free to drop a comment. Really wanna know your opinions on the product itself. <laughs> now don't get me wrong the footage that you're watching is kind of cut up and letting you know the highlights of it there was a lot of time that spent on connecting it with the helicopter remote which was kind of a bug and irritating at the same time however when it did get up in the air it was a great toy to play with so guys that's much going to conclude my video review of the u816 udirc Whew. 
pretty long name, but at an overall viewpoint, I believe that this UFO helicopter is too overpriced at 44 95 and just the overall user experience on it was not that good you would have to have some prior experience to kind of get the toy or gadget itself so i wouldn't recommend for those of you guys planning on getting a toy helicopter to mess around or as a gift for a family member because this one is just too hard to get um, but don't worry, T-Mart also has different helicopters on their website. So it's not only this one. You have a variety that you can choose from. I will link that below if you guys are interested. And like always, if you guys enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Comment, rate, subscribe. All of that would be greatly appreciated. And if you guys have any further questions for me in general or want to know what I'm doing when I'm not making videos, feel free to hit me up on Twitter slash Apple Tech Helping as well as all my other social networks, which I will link below. And that's much going to do it for this video, folks. Like always, you guys know me. I'm Apple Tech. See you.